are constant arguments ruining your relationship? Continued arguments can be very wearing and stressful, leaving you feeling you can't take any more and you want out of the relationship. Maybe you feel you don't want to go home anymore. Perhaps you're staying at work late rather than going home and facing yet another row. Constantly walking on eggshells? Is life miserable? If you recognise any of the above feelings, then you know things have to change. But you don't know how. When you feel attacked, which often happens in arguments, you feel under attack, hurt or wounded, your immediate response to any words of criticism as you see them are likely to respond in picking up negative words, not listening to what anything else anyone said. Instead, you start practicing your response in your head. You want to defend yourself, especially if you feel the accusations are unjust, and then you go on the attack. Your partner feels in the same way, and so the argument escalates to the point the initial issue is completely lost. Here are some tips to help you manage arguments better instead of jumping in with your side of the story. First of all, listen without interrupting. If your partner's ranting, there'll come a point when they run out of steam. Listen intentively. If you start appearing distracted, it will only annoy your partner and inflame the situation even more. Empathise with them by saying things like, Oh, I'm so sorry you feel angry. I didn't realise you felt strongly about that. I hear you're upset. You see, you don't have to agree with your partner, but by empathising, it may diffuse the situation. Your partner will feel heard and acknowledged, and that's a really big thing. Remember, emotions are running high, and this time may not be the right moment to try and resolve the issues. It might be better to step back, step away until you both feel calmer. Take responsibility for your part in whatever is going on. Just don't point that finger at your partner by saying things like, you made me angry. Instead, own your feelings and say something like, I felt angry when. It's less accusatory and it's much more likely to keep things calmer. So those are my tips and I hope they help.